should you get a Mac or a Windows if you are learning how to code? And the answer is absolutely get a Mac. Now, I'm not saying if you're looking to learn how to code and if you already have a Windows machine, a decent Windows machine, to go and get a Mac. I'm not saying that at all. But if you are considering getting a new laptop for your new coding journey, then definitely consider getting a Mac. Do your best. I understand Macs are way more expensive, but it will be worth it. And you should get a used one um, if you're just getting started. That's going to be totally fine, all right? Just a few years old, four or five years old is going to be just fine. Now, the reason, the reason is Macs run on a Linux type of environment. So when you're using Mac, you are using Linux basically, right? They have a built-in Linux terminal. All the tutorials you see, there is a reason why developers always use Macs. Well, almost, almost always, right? A lot of times it's Mac. And Mac comes with pre-built tools like Git and Python, for example. You don't have to install them. They're already there. You kind of have to install different versions if you want to. And installing is not a big deal, but it just gives you a general idea. Macs are prepared for programmers, developers, any kind of a tech field basically it makes things a lot easier just the fact that it runs on a linux type of environment when you're using the terminals on mac you are using linux commands and in a, any it career you are going to run into linux you cannot be an engineer you cannot be some kind of it whether in data science or or even cyber security or anything and even ai you cannot be in that field and not use Linux environment. You just will use Linux environments. 96% of the entire world's uh, websites, where the top million websites or servers run Linux server. So you have to learn Linux server. You can't get around, get around that. So uh, getting a Mac, it just makes your life a lot easier. I've been into tens of meetings with developers. If there are 10 developers in a meeting, most likely 10 of them or nine of them are using a Mac computer. Well, when you work with government and everything is different, but I'm talking about private sector because most of my experience is in a private sector. So your life will be a lot easier. Get a Mac if you are learning how to code or any kind of IT career, but don't feel like you have to get the latest and greatest. Don't go and spend $4,000 for a basic laptop. You get a used one. That's what I did first. Uh, when I first got a Mac, I got like a five year old at the time and it lasted me a long time. It was great. It was an awesome experience. Make sure you get 16 GB memory. Okay, look into that. Look into what to look out for. You gotta look at the processor. You gotta look at the memory. But most importantly, the memory. I see a lot of laptops, it was a good price, but it's 8 GB. You're not gonna be able to do much with 8 GB. So make sure you get at least 16 GB Mac laptop, right? So I have tips about programming and coding and QA automation career in general. So make sure you give me a follow.